Okay, looks like we've got about, oh, eight tenths of an inch. Uh, what it appears right now on May 25th, 2011. Okie doke. Sun's out right now. Actually looks pretty nice, but there are storms all around us. All right, headed north to take some samples. Okay, I'm looking east up Berry Road, and now I'm going to show where the runoff is on the north side of Berry Road, and follow that. It is a little muddy, it looks pretty muddy coming down here. widen out try to do this with one hand Here, and then it goes into the silt pond I'll take the pole. all right thank you this is Greg Carlisle I'm here with Karen, Karen Skinner. Skinner and we're gonna head down past the silt pond now doesn't appear that the silt fence is being breached the last time I was here it was being breached right Yeah, this area looks pretty good, although it looks like it has been breached there before. Should we get our, our uh, first sample? I've got all this dumb stuff I'm trying to carry here. Okay. Get our first sample right here. Good picture of this. Okay. We've come down here, it's coming around, and this is the spot where it's going into the lake. Did you get a full one? Did you get it? Yes, I did. Okay. This is a full, totally full one. Okay, I'm walking back up to the area where I took it, and this looks like the worst spot widen out all the way. This is flowing into the stream that goes right underneath the bridge. Okay, so we know where we are. Coming underneath the bridge. And you can see right here the difference in how much silt there is coming in. Now where this source is from, this is what's coming up over and alongside the silt pond, the second silt pond. So the problem appears to be where I'm coming. Okay. This is the second silt pond and where all of this dirty water is coming from is coming through the rocks in the silt pond which in this area is certainly being breached and is not appearing to be doing its job. Um, I'm going to suggest that, that we take one right over there also. Okay. Where you're, you're uh, down by those rocks. I put in a new jar. And then okay. We'll just have both of them because they look really, really, really muddy. Yeah. All right, we got it. All right, I'm gonna put it on pause. Yeah, it's ready. It's re recording. Okay. Greg is walking over to the second spot where he just recorded the rushing water that got through both ponds and uh, through the the rock. It's it's going around the lower silt fence. And he's getting our second sample, and we will test both of these. This is a close-up of an egg in a nest. And as I pull back and zoom out and tilt up, should give you an orientation to where it is On the north side. in relationship of the bridge. Okay, so it's approximately 
20 feet north. Karen Skinner and I, Greg Carlisle, are signing off because if you look behind Karen, from out of the southwest comes another nasty looking little uh, storm cell headed our way. So we're headed out of here. Go, go do the paperwork. All right, go do your paperwork. See you later. Bye bye.